You drop this. He's still ignoring me. You want him back? Derek says I should apologize until he listens. Derek says? It's good advice. He's my friend. That's good friend advice. Dr. Torres, hey. Hi. Uh, can I give you a hand? He missed the boat, George. You mind this case? Or... or a hot chick gives you her number you're supposed to call. Yeah. I was. I mean, I am. Too late. Good. Ouch. Don't give up. I mean, if you really like her. Ah. Okay. okay, the plot thickens. Oh, Mally, you are a sad excuse for a man. Excuse me? I know you heard me. You're like a whiny little girl. Alex. You know why he's not speaking to you? Because he's not over you. And you got laid. It went badly. A man would move on. But you, you mope around this place like a dog that likes to get kicked. You make me sick. And if it wouldn't get me thrown out of the program, I'd smash your pathetic little face right into that locker. No one wants to pass up a chance for good luck. But does saying it 33 times really help? Is anyone really listening? Hey. I'm feeling strongly about O'Malley. I'll ask him to leave tonight. No, mm, don't. I thought you wanted him out. I do, but not tonight. Scrub cat. <laughs> and if no one's listening, why do we bother doing those strange things at all? Hi. I didn't call. I should have called. I just... Hi, this is George O'Malley calling. You gave me your phone number? I know I should have called sooner, but I'm calling now. And I just want to know, maybe you want to go with me sometime. Because I love to watch you set bones. And I, oh, I really spend that much time in a women's restroom and I really like you so is that a yes